right here on ET now. Vijaya Bank is a company that we want to focus on. It delivered its Q4 numbers and as with every other PSU bank or even private bank for that matter, the profits were impacted by high provisions. Although the NIR growth was healthy, there was also strong advances growth. We'll discuss that and more with Mr. R. A. Sankara Narayanan, the MD and CEO of the bank who joins us now on the show. Good afternoon, uh, Mr. Narayan. Thanks so much for joining us on ET now. Um, like I was saying, while NIR growth has been healthy, we have seen seen profits just about flat due to higher provisions and also lower other income. So what led to this and take us through the key highlights. The first thing is uh, February 12th circular had an impact. Uh, we had a restructured accounts amounting to 11 accounts amounting to 1800 crores which was uh, uh, marked as NPA for uh, current quarter which had impact of higher provisioning which definitely had an impact on the net uh, profits also. As far as the operating profit is concerned, so far the Vijaya Bank has recorded 3,098 crores, which is the highest so far as far as the annual is concerned. And despite challenging times, we are almost at par with last year net profit, uh, improving the provision coverage ratio also from 57 to 60% right. almost. Right. Okay. Um, Mr. Naran, how do you see NPA's rise in the first half of FY19 and even the second half uh, due to Feb 2018 RBI circular? And where do you see your gross NPA's and provisions at by the end of the next fiscal? We do not see any pressure on additional NPA's for quarter or the year as far as 19 is concerned. And uh, we are confident the P, uh, provision coverage ratio, we will make it towards uh, 65 to start with and we'll aim for 70 if uh, uh, we are targeting a net profit of 1,000 crores for the current year. And uh, if uh, everything goes well, we will aim for 65 plus to start with and definitely towards 70 PCR for current financial year. Okay. Uh, how much exposure do you have to the, the first and the second list of the NCLT that was released? How much provisions have been made? And what's the resolution that you're, you're expecting in the NCLT list? In NCLT 1 and 2 accounts, we have totally 10 accounts all put together and uh, total exposure is 2,103 crores and we have provided 1,300 crores so far. That means uncovered portion is only roughly around 800 crores. Uh, we are seeing most of the cases in advanced stage, probably before June or before September, the resolutions must come in and we see a recovery of around 60 to 80 percent. God willing, if that happens, we will have lower NPA numbers and also better profitability numbers. Okay, let's talk about margins. What were they in Q4 versus last quarter? By how much has your cost of funds and yields risen? And what's the outlook on margins going ahead? Uh, my cost of fund is 5.06% and yield on fund is 7.69. NIM margin is around 3.10 percent probably one of the best amongst public sector bank and we are confident to maintain the same level for the current quarter and current financial year also okay just moving away from numbers the karnataka manifesto by bjp includes a farm loan waiver uh, for up to one lakh from nationalized banks cooperatives so what's the impact on your books given election year on total agriculture, as far as Pan India is concerned, we have about 19,000 crores exposure in agriculture. For Karnataka, it may be somewhere around uh, close to 5,000 crores on agriculture exposures. But this uh, waiver, it talks about uh, loans up to 1 lakh rupees. And technically speaking, when waiver is there, the government will compensate whatever amount the bank is going to uh, write off. So it is subsidized or paid by the respective government. So as far as it, it has happened earlier in Maharashtra and other states also, few other states. So this is not a big issue as far right. as... Right. Okay, Mr. Naran, completely out of time on this edition of the show. Thank you for uh, uh, tuning in, uh, ladies and gentlemen. And of course, stay tuned. We have lots more news and updates coming up.